Hi everyone! As 1st of July slowly approaches, we continue our series in preparing for the transition to Google Analytics 4. And today we are talking about how marketers can track social media traffic in the new version of Google Analytics. Lucia, our Head of Measurement, will briefly introduce how we do this at Media Group for our clients. Hi everyone! As a marketing agency offering, among other social media advertising for our clients, how do we use Google Analytics for? What are the main differences compared to Universal Analytics? Yeah, in Media Group, we fully leverage the power of GA4 for our social media advertising services. GA4 offers several key advantages over Universal Analytics that enhance our capabilities and provide valuable insights. Firstly, GA4 introduces a more streamlined approach to tracking user interactions and events across multiple platforms and, and devices. With enhanced cross-platform tracking, we can gain a comprehensive view of user behavior, including interactions on, on social media platforms. Secondly, GA4 incorporates machine learning capabilities, allowing us to uncover deeper insights and patterns in users' data. This helps us better understand user journeys, identify audiences, segments, and optimize our social media advertising strategies for improved results. Additionally, GA4 offers advanced event tracking, providing us with more flexibility and customization options where we can track specific actions and events on social media platforms, such as post engagements, video views, and conversions. This level of granularity enables us to measure the impact of our social media campaigns more accurately. Moreover, GA4 emphasizes privacy and data control, aligning with evolving data protection regulations. It offers more control over data collection, enabling us to respect user privacy while still obtaining essential information for campaign analysis and optimizations. Are there any pitfalls? What marketers should pay attention to? While GA4 brings significant benefits, there are a few considerations marketing should keep in mind to make the most of this platform. First, the data migration. Transitioning from UA to GA4 requires a careful planning and data migrations. It's essential to ensure a smooth transition by mapping and transferring relevant data to GA4 accurately. Secondly, the learning curve. GA4 introduces a new interface and updated data structure, which may require marketers to familiarize themselves with the changes. Invest time in understanding the new reporting features, event tracking, and user interface to maximize the, maximize the potential of GA4 effectively. On the other hand, we have the event configuration. GA4 relies heavily on event tracking for data collections. Marketers should pay attention to properly configuring events to capture the desired user interactions and actions, define clear naming conventions, track meaningful events, and establish consistent event tracking practices across campaigns and platforms. Then we have the measurement strategy. Revisit your measurement strategy to align with the new capabilities of GA4. Take advantage of the enhanced cross-platform tracking and machine learning features to gain deeper insights. Adjust your key performance indicators and metrics to align with the GA4 updated data models and reporting structure. Finally, customization and implementation. GA4 offers more flexibility in customizations. Leverage this by implementing custom dimensions, metrics, and audience segments tailored to your specific marketing goals. However, ensure proper implementation to avoid data discrepancies or inaccurate reporting. Thanks, Lucia, for introducing social media tracking in Google Analytics 4. And if you want to learn more details and specific steps, feel free to read Lucia's article. We have also added some relevant screenshots of Google Analytics panel. The link will be attached. Thank you very much, Valeria. And to all of you, feel free to contact us if you have any questions. Thanks for watching and see you next time.